I, I feel I'm a better manager for it. Um, I can. I feel my team performs better for it. I, I try not to think of it as my development. It's theirs as well. So it's not just empowered me, it's empowered the whole team. Uh, an enormous difference. The, the team leaders themselves are a lot more engaged. They um, are taking more ownership for their own areas. I've seen huge step changes in, in the attitudes, the responses that we see from the team leaders that we're working on currently with our continuous improvement programme around an initiative called MDI2, which is our Managing for Daily Improvements. And in that, we're asking the team leaders to step up, to own their areas, to look after them and manage them as a supervisor, a leader, a driver, an owner, a key stakeholder in that area. And the coaching that we've been through has enabled those guys to step up to that mark. Coaching has had a huge impact on my team. It's got to the stage now where they're self-sufficient. They're answering their own questions. They're no longer coming to me and they're coming up with new initiative ideas and solving problems before they become a problem. I think the operators appreciate being able to have a voice. So it's, it's, it's their voice, it's their opinion that matters, it's their ownership of issues, it's their improvement ideas. There was a little bit of shock when I first tried coaching. People took a step back and had to think about what I was asking them because I've gone from a martyr where I was telling everybody what to do and taking all the tasks on myself to stepping back and asking the right probing questions for these guys to take on the tasks themselves. That frees up their time because it's freed up my time. It's now freeing up their time because the person that was coming them to ask them the question that they probably asked them three times before, you know, they're no longer asking because they have that answer themselves. So the link for me between coaching and engagement is the power that it has to unite and drive a, a force together as one. We have 2,000 people here within the UK and those guys being engaged in achieving more for the business is going gonna, is gonna to pay dividends. It's, it's huge. I think coaching and leadership is the key to engagement. They feel valued and to me if somebody feels valued they will give you 100% because you'll listen to what they've got to say and their opinion matters and it counts. Our performance as a site is going on a, a, a steep journey upwards. Um, we, we've got a fantastic story to tell and coaching certainly will have contributed to, to that um, performance. My advice to a team leader that was new to coaching and taking it on would be to be open-minded, drop your preconceptions and embrace it because it works. <laughs>